And in just the last 90 minutes, 10 News has learned about a last ditch effort to save the opera from closing for good, and it involves a lot of money. Well, just 90 minutes ago, the board of directors voted to give the opera two weeks to raise $10 million to keep it running next season. 10 News reporter Allison Ash is joining us now live. And Allison, this decision was made after a marathon negotiating session. It was a marathon almost five hours long. There was a closed door meeting here inside the Hyatt with board members struggling with trying to find a way to get the opera to get into its 50th anniversary year. That would be next season. When it was all over, these were the words of the board president. We have come up with a decision to postpone the liquidation for two weeks. Board President Karen Cohn says unless there's a miracle between now and April 29th, the San Diego Opera is over. She made this plea to opera fans, the city, and people with deep pockets. Buy the tickets to the last Don Quixote to see the opera and come forward. We need at least $10 million. <laughs> $10 million for the opera facing bankruptcy to make it to the next season. The San Diego Opera is known for its world-class spectacle and the talent it brings to the Civic Theater. The two-week reprieve came on the heels of today's meeting, which brought in the advice of an expert who flew in from New York. Mark Skorka of Opera America told reporters the high salary of its leader, Ian Campbell, and his now ex-wife were only part of the problem. The opera company needs to look at every dimension of expenditure to think about uh, production expenses, um, the, the expenses associated with marketing and fundraising, salaries included, non-salaries included. It's a much bigger issue than that in terms of a comparative analysis that can assess whether the company is operating as effectively as it can be. Many have criticized what they believed was a rush to judgment to close the opera and have called for the board to rethink its decision. That includes fans like season ticket holder Bobby Ball Bradley. Very sad. And I'm just wondering if they can't find some way to resurrect the opera or change their decisions, do something to keep it here in San Diego. And although there has been some criticism of the management of the San Diego Opera, uh, the board president told us this afternoon that they support, the board supports the management at this time. So again, two more weeks added before the board will decide to close the opera for good. In the meantime, they're hoping to sell out tickets to the latest show. And also they're hoping that big donors will step forward and bring their checkbooks. We're live in La Jolla, Allison Ash, 10 News.